Okay, let's take a moment and talk about restrictions. Now, film producers like me, and I've made lots of great movies with kids, uh, we don't like hearing about restrictions. We want to be able to have unlimited budget, unlimited time, unlimited actors, unlimited writers, all these things. But to be honest with you, it doesn't really add that much creativity. Creativity happens when there are restrictions in place. Let me give you an example. So when I was in film school, I would always participate every summer in the 24-hour filmmaking challenge where you would show up, uh, the professor would give you the challenge, you're going to make a movie about aliens or whatever, some type of theme, but we had 24 hours to do it. So in that 24 hours, we'd get our friends together to be actors, we'd shoot it, we would edit it, we would export it, and then 24 hours later, we were watching it on the big screen. And I got to tell you, some of my greatest creativity came out of doing things in that kind of restrictive environment. And a lot of that's why every film producer out there has a budget, has a time restraints, have all these things, and it forces you to be creative as possible. So for you, you're stuck in a classroom. You might even ha still have um, uh, pandemic restrictions around you that you've got to be careful around. And so you've got to take those restrictions and you've got to embrace them and still make a movie. And I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give a shout out to Jaden, who during our first year of remote learning, he produced a movie called FaceTime Terror and all of it takes place in remote learning and it is hands down one of the best movies. Go ahead, go into YouTube, search for FaceTime Terror. You'll see it and you'll know what I'm talking about. He did a great job with that. Using the restrictions of being in remote learning. He made a movie, who knew? All right, so let's go on to the next video. I'm gonna tell you about where you're gonna get your ideas from.